A population is growing happier because of all the military protection provided to our colonies. Well, yeah, a lot of military hardware is passing through the system right now. Good for those people. Mm, guessing he didn't send any communication. No, there's really no point in a 1v1. Light shipyard has been constructed in Aldebaran. Oh yeah, that's the first one here. Which means we actually had a little bit of uh, construction wastage there. So what do we want to build? We probably want defenses in all our colonies. Um, and as a first building we want a space dock everywhere. After that we probably want a second light space yard. Yeah, we'll have to see if we're going to want more yards here. Maybe, maybe not. But uh, filling up 30 kilotons or 30 facilities, lots of space is still going to take a while. So, what do we want for defense here? I'm always saying that I want some more of the um, gunboats. Or when we have them, the Tech 2 version of the gunboats. Uh, but I think, I think an army or two might not be wrong. Or maybe fighters? I'm, not, I'm still not convinced how well fighters are going to do against armies. Mm, yeah, they do something like 13 damage on these things. have. Well, well, I have put a lot of armor on my troops anyway. I guess I could replace this, in, or could replace this with medium armor now too for the one point of a missive. Uh, but whatever. Let's just put a single arm army on each of my worlds. What do you think about that? Then they can't get insta invaded. Da -da -da, let's put them on home world too. Well, so far there's really no reason to put any on the home world. Oh yeah, fine, let's do it. Or any other place because they weren't in danger of being invaded yet. Mm -hmm. And you can probably. Uh, Build more polynomial consumption afterwards. I think it's the other one. Nope, not this one, this one. Syphilis on the ground. Okay. Mm, what's with you? Oh, you're set to warp, right. We probably want to stop that and have you go elsewhere. Yeah. Why exactly do we have this system? Oh, we have the system uncovered because we had a we had a ship going through here. I was thinking, if you went through there, uh, did you walk back, or why are you on this side again? No, no, they came in later. Okay, you wanna go there, and so do you. No, I think I want you to stand watch on that uh, jump point for now, uncloaked, so that you can actually engage things that jump through. You may or may not want to cloak. Do I want to cloak you for just jumping through this turn? No, I don't think so. Because we don't have long range sensors yet, and if there's actually anything on the other side of this war point now, then I want to know about it. Then I want to know about its exact uh, components, and you can only get that if you enter combat. Okay. Uh, these guys. These guys are finally starting to run uh, down their supply since they are now out of range of the supply depot here. Um, I guess I can still move a few tiles more up to there. And uh, then they can meet up with the supply ship. These guys have orders, yeah, they do. This guy is still lacking an order. Well, there's not much here. Oh! I say that, there's a decent asteroid field here. This planet contains numerous miniature alien cities as if some evil mastermind was experimenting with a shrink ray. <laughs> it's probably just a very tiny civilization, a very tiny species then, huh? As if some evil, evil mastermind was experimenting with a shrink ray. Alternate research path for the miniaturization mount. Miniaturization mount. I guess that isn't actually the weapon miniaturization that we have available here. Maybe there's a general miniaturization mount which you can use to miniaturize uh, regular components of ships. That would be funny. So you're going there. And I think you want to uncloak for a while. 
there's nothing in system with you you would see if there was anything in the sector with you and um, we'll recloak you once you arrive here how about that how about you go there and then we will uh, be called to action again when you run out of orders and I step through with spacebar so more warships how about you just go here for now uh, yeah they're self-sufficient they don't need any help to get there and this other recon ship uh, this can also go through or do we want to have it sit on the war point I think we want to have it sit on the war point and see what else comes through what do you think about that and then it can be uncloaked too and regenerate its supplies in case we ever want to send it further <sighs> sounds good to me